Assalamualaikum. I'm Umi. I'm Ata. I'm Putri. I'm Ali. I am Hana. And I am Aiman. Hello, friends, brothers and sisters. Today we have another story. Sharing tales inspires our wisdom. For the benefit of everybody. Beautiful lines, music and song. There's a long life to guide us along. Healing our minds for the end zone. We are being thankful for all the joy. Oh me, oh me, more stories be. Oh me, oh me, we love you, oh me. Oh me, oh me, so patient while we love it. Oh me, oh me, come on and sing along with us. Our reason for all our life. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi taala wabarakatuh. Parents and kids, how's everyone doing? I hope all of you in the pink of health. In today's episode, we'll be looking into our animal friend who is really special. Although it is small, it brings many benefits. It has a tint of gold on its body, and the sound it produces can be scary to some. Can you guess what it is? Well, if you want to know what animal I'm talking about, join Alif, Aiman, Hana, Putri, and Atan at Pono Umi. Here we go. Setiap kehidupan di dunia ciptaan yang esa. Time for lunch. Wakina azabanar. Amin. Mm-mm-mm. Alif, Aiman, Putri, and Hana. When we eat, we can't be greedy. Do you know that greed is one of the bad traits a person could have, or in other words, mazmuma? That's right, Umi. I agree with you. What is Mazmuma, Umi? Can you please pass me? Hmm. Now that is a good question, Putri. Mazmuma is what we call the bad characteristic that Allah dislikes, such as greedy, angry, jealousy, arrogant, and many more. Whereas the opposite of Mazmuma is called Mahmuda, and that is. All the good aspects a person can have, such as patience, being pleased, trust, fear of Allah, and all the positive traits. Putri, yes? it looks like you're out of your greens. Hmm. Poor you. Would you like to have mine? Oh yes, please. You're very kind. <laughs> oh, what are brothers and sisters for anyway? Mm, but you know, Putri, the hand that gives is better than the hand that receives. Absolutely, Umi always say that. But what can I give you, Abang Alif? Hmm, I don't know. But it looks like you're not going to finish that chicken, are you? Hmm, do you want mine? You can have it. Oh, okay. If you insist, I don't want it to waste food, Putri. Since you're not going to finish it, it'll go straight to my tummy. Hana, why aren't you eating? Don't you like your chicken? I do like it, but ew! There are ants on my plate, 
is disgusting. Atai, Atai you're messing up everything. You're welcome, Miss. Is I super Atan Bumio? Atan, why did you kill all the ants? Because they disturb Hana. Mm, 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 mm. Atan, Atan, we must be compassionate towards all living creature. Hana, next time if there are any ants, just remove them gently. There's no need to feel disgusted about it till it made you waste your food like this. But Umi, it was Atan who did it. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, 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 uh. it's all right. There is no need to argue. Just remember, children, we must have compassion towards all Allah's living creature. Okay? Each one of them was created to serve its purpose, whether we know it or not. Children, can you tell me what animal has helped us throughout history? Ah, uh, do you know? Horses. We can ride them for monkeys. Wars. We can send them to outer space. <laughs> Cows, because they provide us milk and make delicious curry. Dolphins, they help humans by performing at the aquarium. How does that help humans again? Hello, I man, by helping its master to generate money. I really like cats because they are cute and kind to me. Oh, I love Jojo. <laughs> Utri, what does your cat like to eat? My cat is very special. It loves honey. Honey is indeed delicious. It also has many benefits. Do you know where does honey come from? From the supermarket. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm, but before it came to the supermarket, honey comes from a very special animal, Ayman. It's the honey bees, right? Exactly, Alif. The honey bee is an expert when it comes to producing honey. Children, would you like to hear a story about the honey bees? We'd love to, Umi. Apis is a naughty drone. Like any other male bees or drones, Apis has a duty to fulfill, which is to be with the queen bee. Expectedly, Apis will go to the beehive that is full of busy working female bees and disturb them. Zzz. Apis went from one corner to another corner. He observed the hard working female bees. He raised his eyebrows playfully. Feel Somebody is busy making those honeycombs. Whoa! They don't look too happy. Let's see what's up with Melly and Farah. At least they would talk to me. Hello, ladies. Looking gorgeous today. What are you girls doing? I'm bored. Oh, Apis, it's you. What do you want? We're busy, okay? Yeah, we are super busy. Unlike drones like you, who just know how to have fun. Hey, ladies, ladies, we drones do a lot too. We work hard to make more bees in our colony. Oh, really? And we, honeybees, only take care of the queen, feeding the larvae, build perfect honeycombs to shelter larvae, and store food. Making sure our home is clean and neat and cooling our hives. Okay, okay, I get it. I'm not as important as the female bees in this colony. I'm just a drone without stings. Oh yeah, I forgot. We also protect our hives from danger. <laughs> I got one! Super Atat is awesome! Oh no, Melly! That is the alarm pheromones I sense! Our hive is under attack! Guys, that's enough! We don't want to make the bees angry! Mm -hmm. It looks like this kid won't give up! If he doesn't stop, our home will be destroyed! I won't let that happen, Farah! I've 
Haha, <laughs> serves you right. I didn't warn you. Meli, you sacrifice yourself. I'd do anything to protect the colony, even if it's costing my own life. Take care of yourself, Vera. Apis, I shall go now. Why did they attack us? Didn't we help them to pollinate the plants for their own use? Aren't the honey produced is to be used as food and medicine? They probably didn't realize that, Farah. They're huge and we're just small creatures. Perhaps their eyes couldn't see the benefits of our existence as created by Allah. I am so sad now that Melly's gone. She was a hard-working bee. I miss her. I agree with you, Farah. She lived by working with full of istikoma. She died for our colony. Please, don't be sad, Farah. Wouldn't it be great if humans can be in our shoes? Perhaps they won't disturb us anymore. Perhaps. Wallahu alam. The end. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I am sure you have heard Umi's story just now. Let's look back at some of the words mentioned in it. The word istiqama means to do something or any task diligently and continuously. For that, we should have istiqama in everything that we do and that includes studying and worshipping Allah. Madhmuma refers to the characteristics that are disliked by Allah such as too much drinking, too much eating, greedy, jealousy, arrogant, and many more. That's it for today's episode kids. Remember to use all of this kalima wisely and correctly. Wa billahi tawfiq wal hidayah. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Have all of you saved today? I have done it, Umi. Five dollars today because my grandma came yesterday and gave me some money for me to save. Wow, that's a lot. Goody good. Professor Gadget Ayman for sure have saved, Umi. As usual, 30 cents a day right into the belly of Ayman's robot. I forgot! Today, it's 10, 20, 30, 40 cents for my beloved coin box. I won't be able to save today, Umi. Just now, I saw a beggar carrying a baby. I felt such pity and give her my pocket money instead. I'm sorry, Umi. Why, that's alright, Alif. Well done! Donating or giving charity is a good deed and loved by Allah. The more we give, the more we get. When we donate regularly, we will get more in return. But we have to do it wholeheartedly and not doing it just to show off. Do you know mm -hmm, that mm -hmm. smiling is also a charity? Atan, have you saved today? Uh, not yet, Putri. I just have 20 cents today. Can I still save them? I don't have that much though. Of course, why not? As they say, a penny saved is a penny earned. I really like your money box. Is it made of used papers and boxes? Yeah, that's right. Don't you know I'm a recycle boy? Why do you look so sad? Are you okay, Atan? I'm alright, Umi. It's just that I kept on thinking. 
of the bee story. I feel awful. Mm-mm. It's okay, Atan. You shouldn't be sad. You're super, Atan. So guilty. I am like naughty boy who got stung in the You're story. You're not the only one. I feel guilty too. Do not be sad, my children. You didn't know about this before. Now that you know, just don't do it again, all right? Time to get ready. You don't want to be late. Okay, me. After hearing Umi's explanation, Hana, Putri, Alif, Atan and Aiman have truly understood the meaning of being compassionate. They also promise not to hurt the animals anymore, even though they are as small as the ants. Ha! Huh, I'm glad that now you already know the animal that is small and give a lot of benefits to human. Like Alif, Aiman, Hana, Putri and Atan, I'm sure all of you also love the animals, even if it is small like the ants, right? See you again next time in another episode of Umi. Assalamualaikum. Bye. <laughs>